all your love, everything you have, the rest of your energy to Nia and Ness. Woo! Friends. And he asked, which one's the man, which one's the woman? <gasps> Do you remember when I told you the brown guy in the halal truck asked me if you and I sleep in the same bed? We used to smile and wave at him almost every day on our way to work. And we still see him almost every day on our way to work. Except we don't smile and wave anymore. We don't smile and wave at anyone anymore. Do you remember when those black teens in Philly told us to kiss? When we were just minding our own business, walking down the street, happy, holding hands. I'm still uncomfortable holding your hand in public. Do you remember when the black Nigerian exchange student in Volteria asked if he could come over and if we kiss naked? We were out in the middle of nowhere. And we thought we had actually made a friend.
wonder what might have happened if he'd had a real one. We remember the black man in Harlem who hit me in the arm as he passed by us. Once you come out and stay out, you'll be coming out again every day, every time you meet someone new. Every time someone new sees you. So we're black lesbians who keep coming out of the closet only to be confined to our bedroom. Because that's all people see when they look at us. Everyone's eyes seem to ask, how dare you two black women be happy? <gasps> how dare you two black women be happy on your own? <gasps> how dare you two black women be happy together? <gasps> how dare you two black women be happy without us? <gasps> Do you remember when our neighbor white Russian woman banged on our door, threatened to call the cops because we were laughing too loudly. You know our non-black neighbor down the hall has a dog that barks all day and all night and was barking at the time. I remember when this white guy we'd never seen before was standing outside our door asking Nia for weed. He said he could smell it coming from our apartment. You know, the only thing she burned that day was sage. And lately, we've been around a lot of white women performing at these women's festivals. And some of them ask us questions like, oh, is this real? Does this actually happen to you? And, What's worse, being black or being a lesbian? This white woman told Nia that she reminded her of her best friend, who's black because they have the same lips. And they keep blaming Trump for all of our problems, as if ours just started two years ago, as if ours might end next year, as if they'll end ever, as if they'll ever just fade into some distant memory. They won't. 